microphone testing one two three oh y'all okay okay y'all my camera's not focusing on the way but we we finna get into this vlog so what's up y'all it's your girl hadassah aka dasa reigns i'm a lifestyle youtuber and y'all already know what i do so welcome to episode number two of this vlog this vlog series um and come with me to class today so today is technically gonna be my first day of classes since I didn't go to class last week, Thursday. I did go Friday, but I don't wanna count that as my first day of class. And I only had one class on Friday. So we're gonna go to class today. We're gonna go on campus and be productive. Ooh, what is this, honey? I think I was slobbering in my sleep. I slept too good. I slept too good. But no, we're gonna go to class with your girl today and go on camp because I only have one class and I do gotta get office hours. So that's what you girl's gonna do today. But before we get into this vlog, um, ow, I just poked myself. Shout out to my nail tech. I am going to insert a picture of my nose right here. And yeah, like shout out to her, but I keep poking myself. But before we get into this vlog, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Like I said, subscribe, get locked in with your girl. And if you're a turner, make sure you like this vlog because you know Hadassah Rings always come back with bangers. And yeah. Yeah, I just wanted to stop to say that this right here, this Biosense Gel Moisturizer, hopefully you can focus, but this right here, y'all, this product right here, y'all, is so good, like, so after I put, like, facial toner and whatever else I put on my face, I'll go ahead and put, like, the moisturizer um, in, like, the middle, and then I'll put, like, a, like, an oil on my face, like a rose oil or something. Um, and in between all of these steps, I try to wait a little bit, but because I'm in a rush a little bit, I put it all, like after I'm done, I go to the next one. I make sure I use sunscreen in the end. And sunscreen is probably like the very last thing I put on. to the bus stop to wait for the shuttle or go to the leasing office and chill. But I'm about to give y'all a quick fit check for right now. So I'm wearing this shirt that I got from this brand called Finesse. I think I got it like my freshman or sophomore year. Uh, there's some shorts that I got from my sister. I don't know where she got it from. And then some white Converse that I haven't worn in a minute, but you can't go wrong with white Converse and some jean shorts. I kind of wish these were oversized, but you kind of get the fit. And my God is Everywhere tote bag by the brand in him. You can't go wrong with that. And that's the fit for today. I don't plan on taking no pictures, but if I do, like, why not? Okay, so I'm about to do office hours, y'all. It's really nothing to vlog for office hours, just doing office hours, but. Yeah, this is who's in the office. Say hey, I'm vlogging. And we have... Y'all met him before in uh, last series in the last one of the last vlogs, if y'all remember him. Yeah, your girl about to just get some work done and start planning assignments for the rest of the staff for student publications since I am the head editor-in-chief. But the Wi-Fi ain't working. Typical HBCU nonsense of the Wi-Fi to not work, especially on a Monday. So, yeah, we gonna see. 
<sighs> Black folks just want to be in the camera. I just want some camera time. Hey, uh, you know, say give off. Greetings, man. Do your, do your Buddha intro. I'm not good. <laughs> <laughs> Divine. Greetings. And my holy salutations from the highest point of Normal's Hill. I am Brandon T. Johnson Jr. Hailing from the grounds of Pensacola, Florida, also known as the Sunshine. You're from Florida. Florida. I'm a Florida boy. Um, also, I am the senator for the College of Agri. Wait a minute. The senator for the College of Agriculture, Life, Natural Life Sciences, and Biology major. Let's go, Buddha. Did you this? just do a rare like oh, the rare is not that's a symbol. What is this? A rare no, is like fist, a right? cat or a, you know, no, fist if we were like the lions or the panthers Harry, or something. I went to Meharry, they just were fist, they were doing this. They were like, No, that's I'm a fist guy. My sister was a Meharry. But anyways, um I was gonna say, I'm from Florida too. What part? I'm from Miami. Uh what part of Miami? Uh Miami Gardens. Uh, I like where the Hard Rock Stadium is where yeah, the golfers play. Yeah. But also where a lot of stuff go down. AKA Murder Gardens. Yes, um, he's from the he's from north of Florida. I'm Florida boy. I'm Pensacola, Florida. We only know him for the beach. That's it. That's it. Pretty much, yeah. Pretty much. And they talking about some shit. Anyways, y'all, Hadassah's hungry. And I'm about to go to the cab to go be a big back and get something to eat. And then yeah, I'm probably gonna go back to my apartment because I have an appointment and yeah. Okay, so y'all, this is what the cab got. This is like some type of pasta. I only said it was good, but now she, it was, no, you said it was good. Now she's saying it's all right. Is it good? How do you like it? It's a five out of ten. Dang. It don't even look appetizing or appealing for real, for real. Okay, we're about to leave the cab because the food was mid. I give it a good, like, six out of ten. Seven at the, no, six out of ten. They just needed some salt. Dog, yeah, it was missing some salt or, like, some type of, like, Cajun seasoning or something. Come on. That was mid for me. I mean, I got a to-go plate. So, who knows if I'm going to eat this later or if it's just going to sit in the fridge overnight or something. But I do got some leftover Chipotle that I'm looking forward to, so. I thought money changed. All right, there, there y'all go. Y'all live in action. Three, two, one. Yo, you already know we got AMU. You already know what the business is. Oh, we got here. Oh, some really shit. Stop playing with us. Stop playing with us. Go ahead and subscribe. Yeah. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. And fuck me. No Limit 0 2 and all that and all that. I don't know what he talking about, but type shit. You got a 400. Type shit. You know, 400. This is just. If you a barber. Wearing around the house. Like, hit my line. I need a cut. Please. Please save me. If you see this, give me a retweet. Please. I'll pay whatever type shit. Anyways, are y'all fresh? Yes. Yeah. Oh, welcome to the hill. What's your major? Civil engineering. Okay. You? Computer science. Uh huh. You? Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Engineering major is computer science. Okay. Cool. What's up? Oh, okay. Yeah. At least I'm doing some y'all. No, I do not stay in Foster. Foster is only for freshmen. I, I just came from the cab. Yeah. So because nightcap is too packed. No, oh, it's like the off rate. It's very mid. I might throw it away when I get home. I don't feel like that. I have leftover Chipotle. I mean, I just you going to share? Yeah. No. Okay. Y'all ready to go? Because they're harassing me. Bye, y'all. They're harassing me. Oh, y'all. They were, I'm not going to say they was harassing me, but they were funny. They was just starting conversations. So I had to just walk off and just let it go because that was a little too much. Y'all, let's get into this sun. The lighting, the sun, the everything. Mm-hmm. Oh, it is right. doing what needs to be done. Maybe I should have took pics today in this fit. I don't know what y'all think. Do y'all think I'll be dressing? Do y'all think I know how to put that on? I think so too. I think so too. You got your real? Yeah. I'm gonna turn my glasses off. <laughs> so y'all, uh, you feel me? I just made some motherfucking uh, quesadillas and shit. I just only had one, but these shit's fine. I ain't gonna lie. Don't talk about my meat. I know it's a little burnt, but it still came together. So that's yeah, I'm gonna do a taste test on these quesadillas. Hey, by Brain. Oh, look, oh, look. I did my best, y'all. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna taste it by itself first. Ghost Rider. A little bit more season. It is good. Give me a little bit of it. It's good. I think the tortilla need to be fried more. Like, fried more. You know how, like, at the taco shop, they be putting it in the thing. They put like oil or whatever sauce on it. Yeah. And then. Well, you know, it's a lot. Nah, I give it like a seven out of ten. This is pretty good. Seven. Seven out of ten. Seven, seven and a half. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
a complete pass. Right? Oh, yeah, what I'm supposed to do. And that's the sense of said. The way I'm tearing this up, y'all, the star. This is I'm hungry too. Thank you very much. Okay, so I decided to be a big bag, and now I'm making me another one. This is my third one. Don't judge me, but I am pretty hungry, and I didn't really eat nothing today, but from what I ate at the cafe, and that was mid, like I said, so making me another one. And then I'm gonna go watch Love Island tonight, cause y'all, the reunion is coming out tonight, and if you know, you know. Y'all know the little dance from Love Island, that's like, I can yeah, that's my mood about the reunion tonight. If you know, you know all of my fellow love islander. And in the comment, y'all drop who y'all favorite cast member was off of season six cast. Because my favorite cast member was Serena for sure. What's his name? He was with that girl. Wasn't Nicole? No, not Nicole, but the guy that Nicole was with. In some ways, and some reasons, I do like him. But other than that, nobody else was really like my favorite cast member. Okay, y'all don't even know it's the morning time, but good morning. What's your girl doing? Your girl is getting herself ready for class because I have to be out of here in less than an hour. Like within the next 30 minutes. I need to be dressed and ready and I took my time this morning because I was really dreading going to class and just being up. I'm going to class today and I'm making sure that I'm going because I haven't been to this class yet. And I don't want no professor trying to chew me out because I ain't been to class yet. And this senior itis is kicking in so hard, y'all. But on the other note, y'all, I got my eyebrows done. Um, I'm walking around looking like Angry Bird because of how thick and black my eyebrows look. And I hate that because this is my first time getting like tinted or henna on my eyebrows and it just, I just look like Angry Bird. But it eats though. I feel like, give it like two to three days and it's gonna marinate. And y'all, excuse the box in the back, but like your girl bought a headboard. You broke, your girl bought a headboard that I was showing y'all that I was carrying in, but yeah, until I get this to the trash, that's what's gonna be in the trash. I'm making me a sandwich because I think I'm gonna be on campus all day today. So I just wanna make sure like I have something to eat or snack on, like if I get hungry, because I know myself. And then I'm gonna get ready for class. I really was gonna dress up today because it's a uh, fried chicken Tuesday and everybody be in the calf, you know, trying to show off they fit. Typical HBC shenanigans, but I don't think I'm dressing up. Like, I don't know. Something in me last night was just like, I don't know if I want to dress up. And I think part of that is because I look like Angry Bird and I didn't want to take my pictures and then my pictures I'm looking like Angry Bird. So I think either on Thursday or Friday, I'm probably going to dress up. I don't know yet, but. And y'all, I don't know if I said this before, but um, I was watching a video or whatever, like a TikTok video, or it was a meme that I saw, I can't remember, but basically the girl was saying how, well, girl maintenance is like, it's not even comfortable in the beginning, or like, it's not even like, how would I say this? Girl maintenance don't be like, oh my gosh, like I just got my hair done, my nails done, my life. Like girl maintenance don't be like that in the beginning because you gotta let everything marinate. Y'all know when y'all be getting y'all hair done, y'all probably don't like it right away. Y'all like y'all like it in the hairstylist chair. But when you get home, you start analyzing your hair and fixing it the way that you want it to look. If you like that. Then when you get your lashes done, you probably gotta get like a mega volume set just so your lashes can look full and fall off. Let the let it fall off for a couple of days so then it can look like natural if that makes sense. And it's just like I don't know, I feel like with girl maintenance as females, we can never win. And then with your eyebrows, you walking around looking like Angry Bird, and that's exactly how I feel. I look like Angry Bird. Now don't get me wrong though, Hadassah love her eyebrows, and I think they're gonna eat as soon as like they start fading off a little bit, but right now, I don't know, they gotta grow on me, but they do look good though. Can't lie. Shout out to my girl, Amber, for doing my eyebrows. Okay, so your girl needs to find something to wear. I have less than an hour to get ready for class today. And it's like I had an idea of what I wanted to wear. But at the same time, it is kind of going to be hot. But your girl don't really care on what people say about what I'm going to wear. We're going to try to make this outfit shape, okay, y'all? And I got less than an hour to do so. And I'm catching the shuttle by the school. So it's like I got to make sure I'm ready when the shuttle comes so that I'm not late 
And what I wanted to wear, I hope it's in here. Cause her also got too much clothes to be looking through everything, y'all. Or she wear this, y'all. Hold on. Um, it's long sleeve, but it's short though. It's like a short romper, but it's long sleeve though. Okay, so y'all. Nigga dance. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. Y'all. Nigga dance. <laughs> <laughs> Dance, nigga. <laughs> Thank okay, let me see a video. Let me see a video there. I know oh, you got a video. I don't have a video, Mr. I don't. I don't. I don't. I'm starting to think these niggas don't. They just. They be on it. Okay, so y'all. Dance, nigga. Dance. Nigga, be getting right the class. I was supposed to catch the shuttle, but your girl's not on time. Do you see facial features? Look, mm -hmm. that's what's Chloe. I <laughs> Are you my friend? That step, this way, that step. <laughs> who's Chloe? That's my friend from Hawaii, real shit. No, who's Chloe? My friend. From okay, so y'all meet my new. We're not gonna call them friends yet, but. Whoa, not me? Yeah. That's gonna be so unfriendly. <laughs> okay, y'all meet my. Well, I don't know, but he's not my friend yet, but meet Damn. my friend. Um, and, and they decided to come and harass me so early in the morning. It's nine in the morning. It is nine in the morning. <laughs> Do y'all want to say anything to the camera? No. no. How about this? Let's go. What up, Carly? Twin? What up, twin? <laughs> me and my twin in this bit, you feel me? Free layer. Yeah, free layer. We in this bit. We well, got long little Joe, man. No, little Joe Bay, my nigga cat just died. <laughs> okay. Alright. They trolling. You vlog for YouTube? Oh, yes, I have a YouTube channel. No, I have a YouTube channel. I'm bossing with my What's your name? Vlogging with Mufas? That how you Y'all so the same as my Instagram. What's how up? you do it? What you mean how I do it? That, oh, that's y'all. Yeah, that's y'all's show. No, I'm just... I can't hit, hit the Hit the Diddy ball. Hit the Diddy ball. What's the Diddy ball? Do the Kodak ball. Do the P. Diddy. Hello. I'm <laughs> Oh, you're a floor. That's all with me and Emmy doing it. I can do it for real. I don't feel like dancing. Y'all, they are so annoying. Like, I wonder how it feels to have little siblings. Because I'm the youngest. And I never had little siblings. But that's exactly what he acts like. She's talking about you. Yes. You're like a mosquito. Like, just, <laughs> just want to, like. I'm the middle child. Yeah, you sure do act like it. <laughs> Y'all gonna see more of, of Trent, but. <laughs> Anyways, your girl was late for her first class, and I really tried because I didn't go to class on Thursday, but hey, we're gonna I try again next week, Thursday. Stop. Thumbnail. Okay, so you guys, today is the next day later. It is Wednesday. As you can see, your girl kind of did some type of beat on her face. And something simple, something slight. You know, Hadassah don't really dibble and dabble with makeup like that. But I'm actually going to be going to the news station with my mentee. She has a nonprofit organization by the name of Start Now Success. And it's just really great. And she has a celebration of success red carpet affair this upcoming Saturday for this this organization um, and it basically brings awareness and celebrates success of young adults like me and I have been a scholarship recipient of Start Now Success um, and I'm just super excited to see the work that she's pouring back into into individuals like me and I can say that I have a lifelong mentor and even like a big sister so shout out to you Dr. Briggs if you ever get to see this video do you want a fit check it's something really slight and I don't think I'm putting on my tripod y'all but I don't think it's I don't know my outfit is really slight but I actually like this uh crew neck oh lord okay I actually like the crew neck that I have on I can't remember the brand that I bought it from but I'm about to give y'all a 360 at it okay so I'm struggling to open up my tripod but I want to give y'all a view matter of fact let me go in my mirror in my bathroom and try to give y'all a view so this is the back of a crew neck it has like this um what would I call this? I don't know, but if you see it, you see. <laughs> and then this is the front of the crew neck. It just says AAMU Bulldogs with the school's logo on it. And yeah, I actually like it. I got it at the AM versus ASU game. They had a lot of vendors. And one of these vendors, they have t-shirts of this made and not just crew necks. Um, but if I find a name of it, I'll include it in the description down below. And as for my wig, I know some of you guys are probably just like, I really want to know where she got her wig from. I'm also going to drop the link for that down below. My honest review of this wig is I got it from
from Amazon. It's an Amazon wig, but the brand. I went on TikTok and I was just trying to find a curly wig that wasn't like catfish. Basically something that's true to length, something that's not gonna shed too much and something that's gonna last and that's gonna, you know, do its job and make me feel like a Puerto Rican. But um, <clears throat> I'm gonna be honest, I got a 28 inch. This is not a 28 inch. This feels like a 26 or 24 inch. Like my hair literally stops like right under my boob or like close by my waist. And I don't know if y'all can see in the mirror, it's trying to focus, but this is where my hair stops um, in the back. It stops like right at my waist. So I really wanted something like in the front that would at least stop at my waist, but it doesn't stop there, which I'm kind of upset at. So far the hair has been good. There has been some shedding, but it's not like a whole lot. It doesn't get matted up quickly. I mean, it doesn't get matted up at all. As long as you wet it, you know, you moisturize, you brush it out, you'll be straight. Really not a lot of maintenance with this wig so far. So there's that. Okay, you guys, I'm with my mentor. Hey guys. Don't tell them she look good. <laughs> it's T, the hair is T, the bob is bobbing. Yes. Okay, you guys, I'll keep you guys posted. Forward and getting that scholarship and then how has it helped you uh, since getting that scholarship? Well being super transparent applying for the scholarship was actually super easy um, it actually appealed to me because like she said you can't raise a child without a village and I come from a similar household so it definitely resonated with me but I was just I was just a go-getter. I wanted to apply for a scholarship being very transparent. I'm an HBCU student, mm -hmm. so I definitely think it's important to go after grants and aids and anything that can assist with my education. Not to mention, it's not only helping HBCU students, but helping those right here in the Rocket City. Absolutely. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. so that's really good. All right, thank you both so much for being with us, and thanks for what you're doing to help yeah. other students thank out you. there. Thank you, thank you for having us. Okay, okay, you guys. Somebody gonna write me. We actually did it. We did the thing at the last minute. <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. Good job, guys. We yeah. had so much fun. You guys, oh come out gosh. to the event. It's gonna be dope. It's gonna be a great event. Well, we had time last night. Anyways, y'all, your girl's about to cook breakfast, and it is currently, y'all, it is currently 1.58 p.m., y'all. Why did I decide I want to make breakfast this late? Um, I was just having a slow morning. I just honestly didn't feel like getting up, so there's that. We're just going to make something simple, some eggs, some sausage. I really need to get some cereal because I have milk, and I don't want this milk to go bad like it. I mean, it doesn't expire until October, but I'm the type of person, I'm still not gonna drink the milk if it expires in October, like maybe mid-September. I wanna show you guys something. I really, really, really wanna show you guys something, y'all. I'm gonna put my camera down to show you. Uh -huh. So, I bought a new pot and pan set. Can y'all see me? Okay, so I bought a new pot. Y'all probably can't see me, but I bought a new pot and pan set, and the brand is called Thyme and Table. Um, so this is kind of like a bronze when you look closely and it has that metallic feel or metallic look with rose gold handles and the bottom is silver and it eats down for sure like it definitely gives grown and sophisticated everybody was kind of telling everybody thought i was crazy for telling me that i spent about 90 something dollars on a pot and pan set but y'all y'all cannot be in the kitchen cooking with pots and pans that don't match each other that don't match the aesthetic of your kitchen and it's not even that you have to buy good brand stuff so that like maybe after a year or two your pots are still looking good i hate going to somebody and knowing that they pot is all burnt up at the bottom and it's like no buy a new one 
so yeah it comes with a one of them is like a saucepan or something another one i got another one but y'all see it's on the stove and I got another one. It's in the fridge because I had cooked the other day. But it's one, two, three, four, five. Five pots and about three lids, I would say. But yeah. And it also comes with these. Like these uh, protectors, I guess. Like if you stack in pots or whatever just so that they don't scrape each other. But I'm going to drop the link for that down in the description below so y'all can see. They also have black and gold available. I was going to get that at first, but I'm really not feeling the black and gold. So, Y'all want to know who my favorite YouTuber is? And I know it's so random. But my two or three top favorite YouTubers are Nyla Simone. She just graduated. Zoe Rose, who also just graduated. And Natalia J, who also just graduated. They all just graduated from college. And I actually like watching them because it kind of gives me a sense um, to... You know, YouTubers who have graduated from college and they're sharing their real life experiences. They may not have their dream job. They may be in their dream job. They may not have their big girl apartment that they want to. They may have it whatsoever, but it kind of gives me hope that, you know, like I could do it too. And y'all, now that I'm a senior, it is kind of scary looking like after this, this is my last go around. It's not like I'm coming back to school again. Like, no, I did my four years, four years in, four years out. That's it. I'm not doing an extra semester. I'm not doing nothing unless I want to do with y'all. And I don't know. Okay, so here go my sausage. And y'all, don't tell me because my sausage is a little burnt. Yesterday morning when I did make them, they wasn't even that burnt, but there my sausage go. And then my eggs about to get done next. But anyways, y'all, that is honestly how I do feel about like senior year. Everybody keeps saying like, you about to go, life finna start, this and the third. I'm very much aware of that, but if y'all enjoyed this vlog just as much as I did, make sure I give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new here, get locked in with me, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next episode. Bye.